Hi! Today, my kids, we're going to find out why do flies buzz? Because you can hear the they go bzzz, so annoying. So let's find out why flies buzz. One bright sunny day, a man and his wife went into the jungle to gather food. When they reached a coconut tree, the man took out his knife. The man climbed up the tree to cut down some delicious coconuts. Who likes coconuts? I love coconuts. They're so tasty. As the man reached for a coconut, a black fly flitted around his face. He tried to swat the fly, swat, 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 and dropped his knife. Watch out, wife, he cried as the knife fell down. The wife jumped out of the way. As she jumped, she kicked a crocodile that was sleeping beneath the tree. Oh, dear me. The angry crocodile's tail went swack, swack, swack. Nearby, a jungle bird was looking for bugs to eat. As the crocodile's tail came down, the bird squawked. Scree, 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 because the bird is here. The bird soared woo, up to a branch in a tree and landed right next to a monkey. The monkey was peeling a juicy mango. The monkey, startled by the bird, dropped his mango and the mango fell on the head of a hippo. Splat, splat, Splat! Dear me! All because of a flight. Dixie Man, go there. The hippo thought he was being attacked by hunters. He tried to escape. Stomp, stomp, stomp. As he did, oh no, he trampled on a bush fowl's nest. This is a bush fowl. It's a type of bird. The nest was full of eggs. Oh no! My eggs are all broken, wailed the bush fowl. She began to cry. Oh, sob, sob, sob. And there she stayed beside her nest for many days and nights. Look at her eggs all broken. She did not awaken the sun with her familiar call. Cock, cock, cock. So the sky remained dark for several days because the sun would wake up when she would go cock, cock, cock. But she was sad, lying next to her broken eggs. So the sky remained dark for many days. You can go there. The jungle animals were worried. They went to talk to the wise lion. The lion gathered all the animals together to find out what had happened. And what do you think happened? Everyone blamed each other. The last to speak was the man. He said, wise lion, I dropped my knife because a black fly was annoying me. Because it started with the man when he dropped the knife, remember? He dropped the knife, the lady got nearly fell on the crocodile and it's so and so it went like that. Aha, said the lion, then it is the black fly's fault. But the black fly answered back, buzz, 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 said the fly. Have you nothing else to say? asked the lion. The fly ignored the lion and continued saying, buzz, buzz, buzz. The lion was angry with the fly and decided to punish him. Black fly, he bellowed, since you refuse to answer, I shall take away your power to talk. The fly tried to speak, but now all he could say was only buzz, buzz, buzz. And to this day, flies all around the world can only say buzz, buzz, buzz. The bush fowl was satisfied. The fly that had caused all the trouble had been punished. And so she agreed 
to once again call the sun to begin the day. And that is how the fly can only buzz. End of story. Did you like it? It's all imagination, of course. Stories like this are all about imagination. You know, you can write anything you want. You can make believe anything. Stories are about make believe. And you can imagine anything you want. I hope you love the story, kids, as much as I love you. Mwah. Bye.